Yeah, follow a black woman that's fucking gonna be a tough <laughs> mountain to climb. Are you guys okay? How's everybody doing? You feel alright? You guys look fucking sexy as hell. <laughs> you doing well? How you doing financially? Are you doing good? <laughs> I'm not like look so good. And I'm straight. I'm straight. I swear to God, you just I'm just I'm sleeping on an air mattress right now. So, a lot of people look good to me, you know? A lot of people look like they're doing well. You guys look fucking amazing. How is everybody good? Getting yeah. sauced up, be able to get Ho Garden. Alright, alright. It was unmarked cup. Uh, who knows? You know? It's a wild night, it's New Year's, right? You guys ready for the new year? Getting crazy? Yeah, you got those resis, baby? Got those resis out, yeah? Yeah. Hell yeah. Um, resis are good. Resis are fun. My one buddy's got a resi. It's um, be with a woman. That's his resolution. Yeah. You know, he's 34. He's getting up there. You know, he's got a lot of uh, he's got a lot of fucking growing up to do. And he's just like, I just gotta be with somebody. You know, she's just going out left and right, left and right. He's like, I went out with this girl recently. We're walking back, and I pulled out a cigarette. And she freaked out. She's like, Oh my god, it's disgusting. I'm not gonna kiss you if you smoke that. I was like, that's hilarious, because I went out with this smoking hot girl recently, and she went to pull out a cigarette, and she saw me looking at her. She's like, are you not going to kiss me if I smoke this? I was like, I'll fucking marry you if you have AIDS. You're the hottest girl I've ever had in life my life. You think a cigarette is a deterrent for me trying to kiss you? Smoke crack in front of me. I'm still trying to fuck, you know? This dude knows, right? It's insane. Cigarettes. New York City. Everyone My parents smoke three packs a day. Hell yeah. Just came back. You guys see family? Fat family for the holiday? Yeah. Yeah. She was like, it was terrible, don't, don't, don't talk to me about it, it was probably the worst experience ever, I completely agree with you, my parents stink, stink, my parents have been together for fucking ever, once you get past, once your parents have been married past like 25 years, it's just like, what are we doing here, right, it's just like, I don't need to come see you guys, it's just a fight, I don't care, right, I had, my parents have been married for 40 years, a long time, right, and I had, I literally had no idea how they met, which is kind of funny, right, I was, and I was bored, I got drunk, you know. Christmas, I had to get drunk, I'm a drunk, right? That's one of my resolutions, stop drinking. It's really not that tough, I need to stop fucking drinking for like a day. I'm like, Dad, how'd you, how'd you and Ma, how'd you guys even get together? You know, back in fucking the 70s, whatever the hell it was, right? He's like, he's like, we were together at a grocery store. Thank you. <laughs> Probably the funniest thing I've ever heard in my life. I'm like, are you serious? He's like, yeah. I'm like, what? I had no idea. Grocery? Imagine meeting your person at the grocery store. And you're not even shopping, you both work there. I fucking died laughing. I was like, that's never gonna happen again. <laughs> never again. How many weddings did you guys go to this year? I went to four. How do you think they all met? Online. That's the thing, right? It's, you gotta just accept it. I was like, that's so funny. Like, marriage stories just from now on out are gonna be so completely different. Ten years from now, little kids are gonna ask their dad, Dad, how'd you and Mom, how'd you guys link up, you know? He's just gonna be like... Honestly, I don't even remember, you know? I know that I DM'd her and she actually answered. And she was 34 and still single, and now we're married. I honestly think that's what it's gonna be, you know? It's crazy. Marriage, oh my god. Um, yeah, so I spent I spent a lot of time with my dad. Now this might this is gonna this is gonna split the room. I'm gonna be honest. The women might hate me after this, but whatever. <laughs> what else is new? I feel like at least photogenically, there were no attractive women until maybe the 1950s. Are you guys are you guys on board or no? Is that is that a hot take? It's a hot take, right? But like everyone uses their marker for hot women back in the day is Marilyn Monroe. I feel like, and she got hot in the 50s. So I'm just using the 50s as my marker. So if you got somebody who was smoking before the 50s, come to me and I'll gladly change my mind. Because my dad decided to pull out a photo of his grandmother at age 22. I'm like, oh, okay, 22. I almost puked. And I was like, I came from this? Are you serious? I mean, the Italian thing doesn't help. She'd have a light stash, but I was just like, holy fuck. Why does every bitch look like they were in the Blair Witch Trials in 1930? This is terrifying, right? And, and I get told a lot that I look older than I am. So you know, it's kind of offensive, right? I get a little sad. <laughs> like I'm on the train the other day and this girl, this girl goes to me, she's like, she's like, how old are you? And I'm like, how old do you think I am? And she said, 36. And I was like, ooh, because I'm 28. So I was just like, yeah, right? She made, I was just like, oh, that, that hurts. You know? <laughs> That's pretty rough, right? But then like a couple hours later, this guy came up to me. He's like, are you Dominican? I'm like, no. He's like, oh, you look it. And I felt a little bit better. <laughs> Fuck it. Older Dominican, right? So I kind of, and then right after that, my dad pulls out a photo of him on his high school graduation. Dude, I swear to God, I thought he was 41. <laughs> I swear to God, I was like, 